Evening News at 5. Been a busy, busy day. Cleanup underway after at least six, maybe more tornadoes touched down in northern Illinois during last night's storms. WGN's Brona Tumulty live in Sycamore near DeKalb. That's where there's a significant amount of damage. Brona. Good evening, guys. Yeah, a lot of neighbors helping neighbors out here today. The National Weather Service confirming at least six tornadoes, the strongest of them likely hitting the Sycamore area, and it packed a punch. A trio of homes out here dealing with that aftermath today. We spoke with Megan Gerwig, a mother of seven. She says she and her family were watching the tornado out the back of the house. It was hitting a farm about a mile from here. They watched it rip the roof off the barn there, and then a piece of metal from the farm actually flew at their house. At that point, they knew it was time to dive into the basement. She says she didn't hear the freight train sound that most people describe with a tornado, but says all of their ears were popping. It felt like they were in an airplane and all they could do was sit, wait and hope for the best. The only thing that I thought of down there, you know, is, uh, I was glad everybody was there and accounted for and, uh, you know, some of the kids were pretty scared and upset and at the moment you just you know, look at your people and you're all there and you just hope that's the way it stays. The family telling us a very short time ago that they just got their power back on, so they're delighted about that, of course. But here at the back of their house, once the storm passed, they were able to come up and see some of the damage. They had a lot of big, big trees at the back of the house. Those trees now are all tangled up with wire and wood and pieces of metal. All of that, though, because it's tangled up in the trees, they acted like a filter. All of that would have otherwise hit their house. There's another line break over here. Some of the trees have been uprooted and snapped in half. Th those trees protecting their neighbor's home right next door to them. And after the tornado struck here, it actually crossed the street and destroyed part of their neighbor's home. We'll have that story for you in an hour's time. We're live in Sycamore, Brona Tumulty, WGN News. All right, Brona.